I'm trying to go to, um, oh wait, um, what is it? Nightclub is OS, right? Yes. Yeah, I'm trying to get into Melee, like, next year. Because Start I love now. that game. I love that game so, so much. You were going to, you were going to need a year of playing in order to get... I've been just watching, getting my knowledge up for them comps. Uh, okay, yes. Um, we'll talk after. Yeah, 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 <laughs> In the yeah, meantime, yeah, yeah. we have this game right here coming up. Bobo opening strong. Yep, and I mean, we have uh, you know, Mr. E coming in from winners finals, reverse sweep in Suarez, making pretty good yeah. wins himself. Meanwhile, Bobo just had the standard sweep on Suarez. Both these guys coming hot off a 3-0 streak. Who will come out dominant though? Right now it's looking like it's Bobo. Keep in mind. Oh, I also I have vague recollections. Three years ago, maybe. Like one of the first times Bobo ever went out to Xeno where he took it over Mr. E. Uh, it was like a really, really big upset at the time. That's all. Oh. Th this, what, yep, this is you. Yeah. I'm getting that back air edge guard again as well. Really good. Against Snake, when you kind of force him low, you're pretty much a sitting duck. Because Lucina just has a lot of um, good kind of staggering tools with that side to just keep herself in place in general. And Misery is definitely going to just come on swinging back to the Bobo right now. But having to just dodge through the minefield right now of Snake, I'll be though setting him back and just trying to lock him down in the corner. There you go. Bobo very smart, recovering on high because you can't let yourself get trapped low by Lucina. Okay. Uh, PSA, where is C4? Oh, it don't matter. Up smash. Yeah, it doesn't matter. However, Good. I see a blanking right there, right? Mr. E able to get the conversion off the grenades as well. And unfortunately, grenade kind of scuffing off that edge guard just a little bit, but Bobo still got that 104 on him right now. Can definitely pop up if Mr. E gets this ledge trap rolling online. 104 is actually not the It's a pretty, all things considered, healthy yep. percentage for Bobo to be in it. Wow, he actually got the near one, but he was too scared of a grenade that made him to go for the forward smash. That's the, that's the power of Snake, man. Play it safe. I'll definitely take that Nair 1, take the damage, and not want to eat anything I, else. I actually disagree. He's down by this much. It's so hard to kill Snake. Take I, it when you can. Actually, you're, you're right, because I didn't even see that Mr. E had one stock left. Yeah. Uh-oh, no jump. And once again, Snake is one of the most obnoxious characters to try and make a comeback Ooh. against. He's going to be making it back to stage, but 167. He doesn't even care. Yeah, C4 blowing it up. Take us right to game two. Granted, because Bobo is on the loser side of things, he needs to take two sets in order to win mm -hmm. here. But uh, based on how that game one went, I mean, yeah. if he just has six more games like that, we basically just go home. Honestly, against a player like E, I want to take it out right now. I want to sweep him before he gets the chance to adapt. Well, you saw what happened to Suarez. Oh, Suarez we saw. Oh, we oh, saw. And then it completely turned around on him. This is why I'm so scared of the older players, because the more time you give them in the set to kind of just gather notes and be like, okay, you know, you know, figure out my game plan, they will disassemble it. Peace. That's like peace. legitimately probably part of why you lost the power on Saturday. I mean, I don't know what that set was like, but... I kind of have confidence that if it was a best three out of five, it, that Mr. E probably would have figured it out because he is like an amazingly adaptive player. Yeah. The thing is, it's not necessarily adaptive. It's just like he starts recognizing a opponent's habit so well. And the way he plays is like, okay, I am very certain you're going to do this, but I'm also going to do something that will cover like four other options as well, just in case. Yeah, it... Now that Let's Play Big Boobs is actually like best of five, I'm very excited to see how a lot of players Wait, are gonna switch it on the up. Entire bracket the entire the bracket? The entire bracket. This just in, the entire bracket. They tweeted it out on the main Twitter, everything is best of five. That's insane. Wait. That's borderline madness, aren't what? I'm gonna show you right now. Much like E showing Bobo up right now, taking that first stock. And doing very, very well. And Bobo looking to clap back with the double back air, forcing himself to go on low. Welcome to Tech City. Makes it on back to the stage, though. All right, Mr. E setting it up once again for this ledge trap. Forward air, getting on that damage just a little bit. Bobo is going to be making it back onto stage. And E senses he wants that roll. He's hovering around for that dare. And Bobo getting his turn on, getting that ledge trap going. Yo, Bobo getting turned on, huh? 
He's throwing up. <laughs> okay, and this is, man, snake matches with snake, and them are just so swingy. Oh, oh, what's the opposite oh. of swingy? It's it's. They just are like a train that goes out of control and like, one way or the other. It's chaotic, to say for the least. Oh, okay. Good up tilt though, managing to sneak it in like just underneath that neutral line. All right, Vogel coming in, swinging a little too much with that dash attack. Mystery setting him back in the corner. Going on low this time, forces him into that up beat. Definitely could have got the back air up, but it doesn't matter. Forward air is closing it on out. And Bobo trying to set himself up for this next up with the eye power of the eye frames, but Mr. E still hot on the tail right now. The grenade surprisingly not blowing up from the down air. Yep. Okay. C4 is right there at the ledge. Yeah, he's Ooh. okay. Oh, so unfortunate. Whoa, I, I'm surprised. Your uh, grenade did okay. detonate when you were he got hit about, by C4. You were saying about the, the tide swinging, the momentum swinging, the trains? I mean, listen, right now, Bobo is basically, he's Mr. Incredible in it. Just like, it's face tanking the train and making to slow it down and possibly even throw it right back. Uh oh. 89% is still quite a bit, and that's 98 right now. Granted, Snake's relatively heavy, so Lucina's is not really going to be killing without like a hard read with a forward or down smash. Yeah, he definitely got to close this out before Bobo gets that reversal that he very much likes going for. And, all right, not able to set up for the ledge trap. Parry. The parry oh, B, that would be was so smart. Ooh. There it is. Yeah, beautiful timing on that nair for the neutral getup. Very good hitbox to throw. It's a very strong move. You would think that you know, wouldn't kill, but surprise, surprise. I mean, Lucina just has so much consistent kill power. The thing is, she doesn't necessarily kill at, like, sub-100 reliably, but she doesn't need to. Her damage output is so good when she's able to continually put and keep people juggled and dis in disadvantage, and then it's like, once you're at 130, what's going to kill you? Back air. Exactly. Neutral air. Freaking up air I've seen. Up B. Up tilt. Up tilt. Like, the amount. The fact that Lucina does not have to worry about the spacing with tippers that Marth does means that the character just... As soon as you reach a certain percent threshold, it just becomes an absolute nightmare staying alive. Yep, you can play it on safe with Lucina. And we're going to see what Bobo's pick is going to be going forward here. I see he's rocking it out. Slowly waiting. Looks like we're looking at Smashville. I can agree he's with that. He's teetering. Smashville is a, is a stage that sort of famously snakes love to stick under. Oh, is it a small battlefield? I can see why E will leave this open. No, pretty good stage for Lucina. It's small, close quarters, so you don't have. Oh no! Well, this is Bobo's kind of thing, isn't it? Oh. Yeah. Well, I was gonna say why E. Um, you know, E would leave it open pretty much. You know, get rid of Hollow. Oh, he's going to get battlefield. Get rid of Smashville. Okay, he's actually going to battlefield. I wonder what his third counter pick would be against Snake. I mean, his third ban. Yeah. Or third ban. <laughs> I'll be honest, I feel like stages kind of converge in terms of quality after a while. Yeah. I do kind of, I, I honestly wish that we would experiment more with adding other stages in the stage list. And yeah, we'll definitely see, much like uh, Legalized Mushroom Kingdom U. I've been saying Mushroom it for, Kingdom U? Yes, I've been saying it's it legal in HDR, I think. What? Uh, Mushroom Kingdom U, I think it's legal in HDR. I believe. What is HDR? Um, it's that ultimate mod. Hey, well, I mean, why, why wouldn't it be illegal in R? R, R? They changed it up. They switched it on up. That game works differently. Right. Oh, no! Oh. That oh. was amazing! He's switching it up. All right. Did you see that up B? Grenade detonates, and then he hops on that platform, reads the heck out of the air dodge, and Thundercats him into oblivion. Mr. E looking really good right now. Yeah, and Bobo kind of locking down E at the ledge. E, very good spacing on the forward area. Even if he gets buried, he will get punished. However, you're going to be holding that as, uh, you know, you're playing against stakes still. This is still Bobo. It's his ball court. And right now, Bobo kind of balling with the grenades, playing a little 
back and forth with Lucina, Mr. E right now, and he comes on swinging with the dash attack, still lobbing the shots, lobbing up the balls. Yeah, Mr. E forcing him to this corner right now and not letting him breathe at the moment. But you give him space, he'll get that grenade pull eventually, so you just gotta wait so you can punish it. Yep, ball to throw it out. Set up for this lift trap situation, and you notice that Bobo in these situations have been going on high, which I really like because that kind of just negates Mr. E's list trapping and doesn't let him play his game. Man, Mr. E's reactions are so good. You notice that he down tilt, normally he goes in for a tech chase with down smash, but then saw the grenade was about to detonate and instead goes and tries to chase him all the way up at the top. I Didn't love actually connect so, so anything, nice. but still you notice Mr. E is just so aware of all of these projectiles that are constantly out. Yeah, and Bobo is really trying to slow this down. You can see it with the grenades as well, because he does not want E to take this. And Bobo finally lands that stop at the back here, but he does have 188. One up tilt will definitely do it as Mr. E comes in sliding, but the C4, you know, throwing it up, but the delayed up there on the shield. Ooh. That was so good. Just the frames before hitting the ground, and Bobo was definitely baited into dropping his shield. So. Good stuff to Mr. E, but still down, and man, he just couldn't kill Snake before. I was like giving glowing reviews on Lucina's kill power, but Bobo's survivability is making me making me look like a fool. Yeah, Mr. E, give, give, give me back my credibility. Kill him at like a hundred, <laughs> please. Bobo making the looking to make E look like a fool right now. Trying to lock it on down because you cannot be swinging like this onto Snake when he's up in that shield, but. E kind of continuing his up air assault right now, building up that damage. You know Snake has that explosive kill power to kind of just obliterate that stock like it's nothing. So, oh, yep. Platforms there definitely save you from that up B. Man, Snake back air has been pretty good work this matchup. Mm -hmm. well, maybe that that time. E kind of swinging with that F2 right there to get up that damage. There's a Nair one. Keep it safe. Keep it in shield. Try to bait out that option from the shield. Is that Nair one? Yep. Converts to the upper with the grenade. Bro, he's Bruno Mars. He's singing the whole verse. I'll catch a grenade fire. Throw my hand on the believer. He sang the whole verse. Uh, don't take life advice <laughs> from a man who's openly said. He would jump in front of a train for you. Bro, bro. Turn off the Bruno Mars. I see you're playing in the headphones. That advice is not helping you. Yeah, switch to Kanye like all of the <laughs> all of the other top level players. Oh my Man, god. Man, is it okay to say that if HBox still listens to Kanye, uh, that's problematic? I, I got zero clue. I got zero clue. Hold me on. Oh, just runs right in. Yeah, and I see we're running back to small. Uh, All right, uh, pop quiz, field. where's C4? Nowhere. It was right there. <laughs> he just blew it up right there. But yeah, Mr. E was right underneath it. And he knew, though, he was shielding it. Oh, he used the grenade to boost himself up there. Getting a little this air is, dash in the game with yeah. no air dashes. It's, a, it's an extended movement option. I'm loving this. See? is that matchup Pacific knowledge that you only see here. Oh, oh yeah. Looking to trap him in the corner as well. Up air is forcing Bobo into the situation. Cypher won't be able to save you this time. Trying to go on high, but Mr. E, you know, he's covering that space. He's looking at you. He's staring you down. Pivot, F tilt, kind of slide on in and hang low with that bear. You know, Texan on out. I, he might have been dead anyway, but that DI looks like he wanted to get to the blast zone as soon as possible. That yeah, wasn't looking the best, but I love it. Using the throw invincibility to just get that damage on up. However, E got to dodge through the fire and the flames real yeah. quick, and there's that down smash, closing out that sock, making this a nice and even game here. Yeah, Mr. E was a little bit too cheeky. He had to, I don't know exactly what he was going for, but he was forced to grab ledge without invincibility. And yeah, snake down smash is yeah, You never want to be in that situation. Yeah. You know, Mr. E's making really good use of this kind of patience that he got going on, the spatial control as well, you know, trying to look for this opening because he knows that Bobo having the greatest unlock, but not trying to get that Bobo sauce right now with the DI in, avoids the forward air, never want to get spiked by that hitbox. Man, Bobo's being his grenade play right now. It's Ooh! Brilliant. Oh, and Throw it off, out there. Offstage stuff ain't too shabby neither. 
99 on Bobo, and that's, once again, he was living to 188 on this stage before. Yeah, and E calling him out with the stack of death till as well, the up forcing him, but, ooh! That was so good. E is one of the best players at, like, going for something off stage, and just in case you survive it, he will follow through and make sure to cut down your only means of escape. Yeah, but he's still hacking and slashing away at Bobo right now. There's that empty hop grab, mixing it up just a little bit and trying to force him to this corner. Bobo trying to play really safe on the flats, but you cannot challenge that parry game. King, pivot, oh. F-tilt, putting him back in the corner once again. There's that up beat. Okay, pop oh. quiz, where's C4? It's right there. The flat, <laughs> mystery, <laughs> getting clipped. Oh, I, oh! No way, oh! Okay. Everybody's alive right now. Everybody can't take alive. another one of those up tilts though. And Bubble can't take another back tilt. He can't take another. Oh, anything. the yes. wait for the down smash. It's so good. So many players have been too scared to just hit the get up attack button when E runs at them like that. But brilliant stuff. E, that game was so close. That up tilt almost killed on any other stage besides I, Battlefield. I was so shook it. from that up tilt. I, I thought I was going to kill.